Hello everyone, welcome back to Glenlatan for a new episode in this gameplay series. Uh, I hope I pronounced the name of the map right, if I didn't I apologize for that. Uh, today we are going to start working on our arable fields and let's get into this tractor over here that we bought last time. Uh, the first thing, the first job we want to do is uh, to mulch the fields, to remove the stubble and we have a mulcher right here, I don't know how that happened if you see that that mulcher is facing the wrong way let's try and uh, get out of this shed over here I think it will take a few maneuvers but uh, in the end uh, I hope that we will be able to get it out I hope I don't know how this happened, but it doesn't matter. We have also a full pallet of wool over here. Pallet and a half actually. So that's good. I think the best price for wool will be next month. So in March. Probably I'm gonna sell the wool, then I'm probably gonna sell some more milk. Until then, the animals should have at this point enough uh, food. So, yeah, in this episode, we are going to uh, do a lot of time lapses. Why isn't this working? Something is wrong with my game, I don't know what. Oh, I just need to lower it, not unfold it. I'm stupid. Or at least I feel stupid. Okay, let's close this menu over here and let's start the, the time lapse. I'll see you back after these two fields are merged. Thank you. 
the munching is now finished, uh, I will have to check. But when we get to the farm, is any of those fields require lime? I don't think so. But we have to check, and then we can get uh, this cultivator over here and start uh, start cultivating those fields. And afterwards, we have to see when we can drill. I'm thinking about putting in oats for uh, this year in both both fields. This way, we also get the straw, so we can put uh, in the cows to the cows. Maybe until next year when we'll have to fertilize again, uh, we will be able to afford a salary spreader or a manure spreader because I think we have both salary and manure from our cows. So that will be good. We can save some money on fertilizer. But okay, let's check these uh, two fields. None of them require lime. They also require another stage of fertilizing, but I'll do the the other stage of fertilizing after uh, I cultivate. I think we should be able to, at least. Also, another thing I was I wanted wanted to do in this episode was to go a little bit to the settings and increase the where it is sound settings i need to increase the volume a little bit uh the vehicle volume because i think it's pretty low so i'm going to put it at 100 percent also also i want to check something in uh, in here for the vehicle control add-on settings control c okay i was pressing the wrong buttons earlier trying to to get into these settings because I want to try and uh, see if we have an option for draw marker lines never so basically I think right now when we activate the vehicle control atoms we won't see the lines on the screen it should be nicer to watch not to see those lines every time so let's uh, get cultivating I think this should be a three minute job we have a big cultivator and then we will have to see if we can apply the fertilizer right now or we need to wait until the drilling will be done to to do it i'll of course also do this part the cultivating part in a, in a time lapse and uh, see you when this is finished
cultivating is now over. Now let's go put this cultivator in a shed. I think I'll put it next to the harvester in this shed over here, the most close shed to us. Then let's go get the fertilizer sprayer and see if we can apply the second stage of fertilizer at this point. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work, we can apply it after we drill. Then for sure it can be applied, but if it works, it will be, uh, let's say, one less activity to do after, uh, after drilling. So maybe after we drill we can see about doing some contracts or something along those lines to be able to make some money or just skip time forward until our grass is ready to cut I don't know right now, I haven't decided but uh, yeah the plan is to get this sprayer that we have over here uh, I think we have, we should have some fertilizer in it uh, I also want to try uh, it's almost full, I'm not trying anything I was saying that I want to try to get fertilizer out of this shed over here actually let's check shall we, while we are here, yeah, we can put in here I don't know why the small sprayer that we had until now wouldn't let me get fertilizer out of that building over there but I'm glad this one does it makes life much more easier I don't have to basically go to the store every time I need to refill with fertilizer I can just have some delivered to the silo in the f in our farm and uh, use it from there I think I need to move way over here I think I need to get also a little bit further off. Uh, why is not working? Okay. okay, so see the ground color is changing, so that means we are applying the second stage of fertilizer. I'm gonna do this in a uh, and I'm gonna do this and I will see you actually in April morning. I needed a good night's sleep after all the work I did in the previous day. Uh, let's see... We have two pallets of wool, that's very good because I think today is the best time to... to s today, meaning April in game, is the best time to sell. I don't know what's happening with, with uh, the machinery in the shed because if you remember the mulchers, I put them 
straight, no return angle. Something's fishy about this map, I don't know what. But okay. Uh, so yeah, today I think is the time to drill oats. Yes, we also can put barley, potato, sugar, beet, sugar cane, doesn't matter. We are going to put oats in our fields. Our fields are fully fertilized twice right now. Uh, we need to get some seed. I think I should have seed in, in this side over here, if I remember. Yes, oats. We are going to put oats. And let's get to the big field. We are going to do the big field first and then move to the smaller one. After that, we also need to roll our fields. I don't remember if we have rollers. We have grass rollers there in here, but I don't know if we have field rollers. Let's check. Uh, we have mulchers, plow, this carrow cedar. We don't have a roller. So maybe it will be a good idea to buy a roller. Let's see what we have in the sale. Oh yes, we have a telehander, but we don't have that kind of money. And the big X9, okay, we cannot afford those. Uh, so yeah, I will see about that roller, maybe, mm, I don't know, I'll have to think. I would like to roll because it improved the yield, I think, by 5% or 3%, I don't remember exactly the point. It improves the yield, that's the bottom line. So yeah, it will be it will be a good idea also to to roll these two fields, but uh, we'll see what options we have in regards to rollers. If we can afford something, then okay, I'm gonna get it or lease it or I don't know, and we are gonna roll. Otherwise, they will have to go like this, and will take a little bit of a hit when it comes to to the yield which is not that big of a problem so let's uh, do this fast in a, in a time lapse uh, I will see how much I would have been recorded after we finish this and decide if we are going to roll in this episode or end it after seeding or drilling whichever way you want to call it and uh, finish the field work in the in the next episode
okay everyone so we managed to finish drilling the big field of oats the field 34 i don't know why i call it the big field maybe because it's our biggest field that we have we managed to finish drilling it with oats uh, now we have to move to field 29 but uh, that will happen in the next episode i will end this episode here i don't want it to be too long but you know me i said that uh, i think also last time and uh, the time before that but okay i'm hoping it won't be too, too long let's uh, refill this drill with uh, with some seed and uh, i will off camera take it uh, take it to the field i know how much seed i have in this uh, silo over here ah, we still have 2800 liters so it's okay so this is it for this episode i hope you are still enjoying this year series if you do please give me a like if you want to watch more of my videos subscribe to the channel and in the end i'll see you next time thanks for watching